Hi, I'm Antonio Centeno, the founder of Real Men Real Style, and today I'm going to be talking about the black suit. All right, there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of people out there who will say the black suit is something that you shouldn't do, you shouldn't wear. I, I'm not, it's hard for me to take a stance on this because I used to be in the camp of you do not wear a black suit, but having been a custom clothier for a while now and seeing that it's still one of the most popular fabrics out there and having been exposed to a lot of men who actually look great in a black suit, even during the day, even under uh, unnatural indoor lighting. I'd have to say that for the right man, the black suit is a, is a great piece of, uh, is a great suit to own. I still do not think it should be the first suit a man's man owns because I think a charcoal gray or a navy is going to be a bit more versatile, isn't going to be as stark of a contrast. But the fact is, it looks great on some men. So my answer, whenever anyone asks me, you know, what do I think about the black suit? I say for the right man, it's one of the top three suits he should own. But again, it has to be the right man. So let me let me talk about who that right man is. And if you fit that description, great, consider it. If not, I would avoid it. Okay, so black fa- the black fabric, it traditionally is a very formal fabric. It, you would see it in evening wear. So you would see it in the black tie, basically the tuxedo. That's where we see black and where, you know, you do see occasionally see tuxedos in midnight blue, but black is traditionally the fabric of evening wear. So that's where there's a bit of, you know, people feel it needs to stay there. Also, a thing with black is it's for stark, high contrast individuals. So you need to have very dark hair. I mean, my hair, I don't even think it's, well, I don't like my black when I wear it because I don't feel that my hair to my skin, there's enough contrast there. I'm a medium contrast individual. If you've got really dark black hair, uh, a lot of Italian men, it looks great on them because they've got that black hair, they've got that olive skin, a black suit looks amazing on them. And they've got that color within their skin so the black doesn't, because black tends to suck out color and that's why it looks great with a white shirt because you've got a, you know, where it reflects all color. And then you've got the black, which is soaking up all color. And, and that contrast right there is very powerful. If you're an Irish gentleman, you've got, let's say, black hair with lighter skin, you can pull it off, but it's going to be a bit harder indoors and under unnatural lighting conditions. It can pull a little bit too much color out, out of your skin. But if you're wearing a tie, which has a little bit of vivid color, that'll help. So it's for formal wear. Uh, that's one of the arguments that, you know, it's it's a bit dated of an argument. The other one is the stark high contrast. This still applies. So if you've got red hair or light colored hair and light colored skin, or basically between your hair and your face, there's not a whole lot of contrast. You've got medium brown hair and reddish skin. The black suit is probably something you're going to want to avoid. It's just, I would go with a lighter colored suit. I mean, a charcoal gray is going to be fine. A medium gray, probably better. Navy, great suit for you. But black, almost just too much, too stark of a contrast, not going to be probably the best suit for you. The other one, and I I started talking about it, is how black absorbs color. So if you're going to wear other, you know, other things with it, like a dress shirt, which of course you'd be hopefully wearing a dress shirt with a blue with a black suit, but you're going to want to pay attention to, is the black suit sucking some of the color out of it? So you're going to want to avoid a, a lot of the pastels. They're just going to make it almost look like an off white and it's just not going to look right. Instead, go for, uh, I mean, the only thing you want to go with is either a white or go with then something that has some strong color in it, which can, can kind of offset that, that, that that absorption that the black does again and you can also pull it off with a tie so you could actually wear you could wear a pastel colored shirt and a pastel is nothing more than a color that has a lot of white in it you could pull one of those off if it reflects well with the tie that you're wearing another great thing about black and why a lot of men are drawn to it is it is one of the most flattering colors for forming a very lean silhouette. So if you're a little bit heavier of a gentleman, you've got a little bit of weight in the midsection, I'm not, it's not gonna make you look thin, but what a black suit will do is it will help trim you up. It will not make you look fat. So women know this, you know, the little black dress, all that stuff. A black suit for certain men under certain conditions, especially if it fits his body well, maybe doesn't have vents in the back. It, it, it just really is, is a good fit there. When you look at a guy head on, it's going to actually maybe build out the shoulders just a bit, l- tighten in that midsection. He's going to look lean and mean. Okay, uh, 
so what's my final conclusion? What, what, what am I going to say about the black suit? Again, for the right individual, the black suit, one of the, one of the three suits that, that you should own and, and definitely you can pull off. It's not just for funerals. It's not just for weddings. You can, I mean, look, look at Tom Ford. The guy wears and rocks a black suit everywhere he goes, you know, whether he's walking down, you know, the streets in New York City or he's in Vegas. I mean, the guy has always got that black suit with uh, that crisp white shirt with the, with the high, uh, with the high collar, you know, collar ends here. It looks great. And a lot of it's about confidence too. You know, don't, you're going to read stuff on forums. You're going to read stuff uh, on websites where people are going to, you know, tear up the black suit. Again, my opinion, if you have the right hair, if you've got the right contrast, go for it. All right, Antonio Centeno with Real Men Real Style. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. I've got a lot of other videos out there that I think you're going to enjoy. In addition, you want to read more about this, the article, the link should be right down there. And beyond that, uh, let me see, my Facebook page. Go to uh, Real Men Real Style's Facebook page. Ask me a question there if you've got it because I try to respond to all those. My email list, actually, that's the best way to get in touch with me and to stay in tune. We, we work with a lot of other companies. We put out a lot of discounts, at, which I don't put on my Facebook page. I don't put anywhere else except I put them out on email. In addition, once a week, we put out some great articles and even some unique videos, which you won't find on YouTube or anywhere else. We put them out through the, uh, through the email list. So Twitter, we're on Twitter as well. And uh, again, if you're checking this out on YouTube, subscribe and I will see you later. Bye-bye.